I've just removed the gate it just slips off and I've taken out the four screws from this uh, sort of rear aperture plate arrangement and as I've lifted it off underneath it says patent so if you thought they're copying anything around here and you got caught there would be no plea of well I didn't know I managed to get the lantern off the rails which will make life a little easier especially when cleaning up the lantern now underneath the main mechanism there is this device with a spring and this isn't just for pulling the mechanism across it's also adjusting these so that it can actually slide and that will then uh, and this handle will then lock it in as required so kind of interesting don't remember seeing that anywhere before because we don't normally look underneath these things do we I said before that there was any light rust on these but actually it's not that light so that's got to come off as much as possible before I try to move the mechanism along those two rods the mechanism actually slid quite easily off the sliding rods which I'm calling them and um, what's happening here is they're actually pretty badly pitted for one halfway their length so I've been grinding off the rust with the uh, drill grinder just starting to do that and then at some point I have to get these nuts off the sidebar the other side came off easily and these are not cooperating uh, but I'm working on it the rust is quite heavy so I'm going to do some grinding now Those sliding bars now are almost there. In the heavy pitting there's still some rust as you can see but to get this far I've had to use a standard size grinding piece which has been worn smooth and um, two or three of these smaller ones. I'm just about to use this one to get to into those final pits to get to loosen up what's what's left of the corrosion um, and then obviously in between all of those grindings uh, some emery cloth and oil and I'll have to finish off with a finer emery cloth and as you can see it's now blending in much better with the unrusted part of the rods so I think it was well worthwhile to do that rather than have them rusty. Nearly there. The crank handle has been in vinegar overnight so I shall now be scraping that off and that will have loosened up, in fact removed some of the rust and loosened up the rest. And I didn't take off this ebonite or vulcanite handle because I can't get that nut undone despite heroic efforts so it's staying on there it doesn't really have to come off it just makes the cleaning up a little bit more difficult so the next job finish the cleaning of the crank demonstration of the safety shutter there we are 
fully working.